My friends, today I'm pleased to announce that we're making a video that I never thought I'd be having the honor to make. Today, we're going to be covering the Balloon Shipper Paragon and Balloons TD6. Ooh, all right, you know everybody that I love me a balloon chipper video. So we back. All right, we got the balloon chipper, and not only do we have the balloon chipper, we have a paragon balloon chipper, the balloon ripper. Not recommended for any operation by monkeys three and under, or anyone really. Yeah, you know, two million dollars. That's a lot of money. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. All right, all right, we're gonna need to start getting some big pops here. All right, let's get some, let's get some, I mean, vacuum cleaner is really nice. Integrated sorting AI allows the balloon chipper to suck up bananas without chipping them, which is nice. Here, we'll get suckier. Uh, let's do heavy duty suction. The heavy duty suction, we need dual layer, dual layer blades. Dual layer blades array pops an extra layer, which is really nice to deal with the blue balloons. Do we want, uh, which one's better? Probably faster shred. I think faster shred's like way better to have. But I think we can focus on trying to get the banana farms up and running because because we need two million dollars. I am so excited to see what this balloon chipper has because a pair, balloon chipper is already the best tower in the game. Like, look at this, look at this beautiful man. Look at this beautiful balloon chipper. All right, it's putting in work. All right, it's just putting in like the it's putting in effort. All right, he's going all the way dude should i get the i see i kind of want to get the rubber the latex industry but it's really like not that much money it's much better to just focus on getting the banana farms up and running and then just get the stronger versions of this bad boy as soon as i can get marketplace i'll upgrade the balloon chipper just a little bit more because right now i it's it's a little bit weak right now and with dual layer blades and faster shred which is like you know fifteen hundred dollars that's gonna be like it attacks faster and it does two layers of damage at a time this thing's damage is gonna go through the roof they're coming out with the new update really soon and i'm really excited for it because it's the uh it's the new like shopkeeper hero like geraldo or something like that i kind of forgot exactly what yellow region balloons are the bane of my existence when it comes to banana the not that the balloon shipper like look at this thing they just you can't look at this they're like invincible bro they're very tedious to deal with. Regen balloons on balloon chippers are like, I need to get a village. That, that's basically, all of my complaints are solved when I just buy a village. Let's go ahead and get the dual layer blades because the dual layer blades will pop an extra layer, which is just like super nice to have. Come on, ah, please, please, there we go. And then we're gonna need to get the faster shred because faster shred, Allows them to attack even faster. See, here's the thing. I have so many things that I need to buy now. I got so much stuff. I have so many, so many problems here. Let's just, I'm just going to upgrade this guy to triple shot. Like literally upgrading this dart monkey to triple shot will just solve pretty much all of my problems immediately. Immediately. Or having, I want to put like an ice monkey down here eventually as well. But right now, the most important thing is we need to get money because we need, again, I have to preface two million dollars for this paragon, okay? I don't know why it costs two million dollars, but it's gonna cost two million dollars. I might end up selling this balloon shipper so I can get another one that's like right in the middle. Because I kinda want it to be like super symmetrical and amazing and like cool looking, you know what I mean? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it right smack dab in the middle. That's not in the middle. It needs to be like it needs to be super symmetrical. There we go. Now that's symmetry. Let's go ahead and start getting the upgrades. So this one could be the bottom path, actually. So this will be the improved sensors, the rubber processor. And then, uh-oh, uh-oh, I am in trouble unless I buy a bomb shooter. Thank you. I have your target strong. And boom. All right. That's exactly what we needed to deal with. Faster shred. So this guy's making us just a little bit of money. So that's our, here's the bottom path. This guy will be this guy will be top path, so we can start working on that. Or do we just? I need more money. I wish that there was like a salesman that tried to like sell you on these upgrades. Like, <clears throat> make sure to come down and grow 16 banana bunches per round. Or please invest in a monkey bank. All money generated by this farm is now stored in the bank and earns 15% interest each round. You know, what a steal! 
or come on down for the Banana Research Facility. Produces five large banana crates every round worth $300 each. Now that's investing. But if you buy two Banana Research Facilities, we'll give you the second one half off. But hurry, this deal will only last for today. And we're gonna have to go up against a Moab very soon. Uh-oh. All right, give me Shimmer. All right, we, oh, I, by the way, I got the new Necromancer. Like, the new Necromancer balloons, and they look super cool. I actually think they're, like, so good. All right, will I be able to, to deal with this? Probably not. So we're gonna get this guy, and I want super wide funnel. I need $8,000. I probably am not going to be able to afford $8,000. Maybe. If I can get it, like, right at the end of round 40. Come on. Is he going to give me enough? Please. Please give me $4,000. Oh, no. I'm in trouble. Actually, I think I'm okay. I think I might be okay. Uh, if the, as long as this guy doesn't run out. I think we might be in trouble here. We were very in trouble. I was not ready for that. So now this guy's just gonna like shred it. There we go. Okay, that was just me being lazy. I could have I could have done something, but I was like, I don't want to spend any money. I just want to sit here and be lazy. And that's what I got for being lazy. I lost. Now we need to start actually getting upgrades for these these things. So there's the super wide funnel. The hydraulic Moab compressor is gonna be really nice to have. We'll put you on strong. You're gonna be our middle path. We need to get the super vac. I'll work on that. And then I I don't want the wizard monkey anymore. I don't need it. I got the super the super vac, which is the awesome ability, which allows faster suction over a longer range with infinite capacity for eight seconds. So we can start working on that. Like look at this. And it just like absorbs everything. We are seeming to have like, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we're uh, not doing too hot. We need to get some more, some more firepower. These things are doing okay. I want the black hole generator. The black hole generator is $100,000, but it is very much so worth it. Like very much so worth it. What we can do is we can actually send like a couple of rounds a little bit early to make the money. Well, we do need the $2 million. That's what's so difficult. Okay, give me banana central. Yeah, look, now we get a Banana Central. Like, once you get Banana Central, it's just, like, crazy how fast you make the money. Crazy. All right, Black Hole Generator. All right, now we have the Black Hole Generator. I am very confident that we're going to be, like, big fine. It just destroys everything. Thank you. All right, I can go ahead. I don't know if Monkey Wall Street's actually ever worth it to get. All right, now we should start working on getting all of these things. Like, we want to make sure that we have all of these towers. So, the hydraulic Moab compressor, latex. So, we can get the, the balloon ripper now. Does this give us any money? That's a wide. That is a wide balloon shipper right there. All right. Let's start working on trying to get ahead so we can... Or start getting, like, tons of things down. So, we can get a higher level of Paragon degree. So, we can put down some extra T5 towers. Because I would love to be able to get just, like, the craziest strongest possible paragon we're probably not going to be able to get you know a, a t100 but we have infinite tv5s on right and they're all going to contribute and they all cost like a hundred thousand dollars in their own regards so if we get over to like a, a fifth a paragon degree level level 50 honestly i think i'd be okay with that we just need to get to like the two million dollars we're at round 92 uh oh, I really hope that these, like, DDTs don't show up and mess me up. All right, here we go, my friends. Are we ready to get the Balloon Ripper, my friends? The Balloon Chipper Paragon. If you're excited, please hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Helps us out tremendously here on the channel. We're trying to grow the channel, hit 2 million subscribers, and we need your help to do it. But uh, enough advertising. Let's go and get the exciting stuff, the Balloon Ripper. Let's do it. A seven. Oh my gosh, that thing looks so cool. We won, but that's... We gotta go into it now. Alright, let's see. Alright, let's sell all of this. That looks so raw, bro! It has, like, swords on it. And then it has the blades. The Blue Ripper. I love the symbol for it. It just absorbs everything. It just is a black hole. It is a paragon to be... Oh... Are you guys seeing how strong this thing is? This thing is bonkers. Look at it go. It just annihilates. It just eats everything. It just eats everything alive. Round 98. All right. What happens? Are, go, get, that was a BAD. Does anything get past this? 
Look at this thing's pop count. Oh my gosh, it is in. Look, this thing's a monster. It's look at all the balloons. They're like ah, they're like in there taking me away. Ah, we're not. <laughs> Okay, this is peak comedy. All right, let's go all the way to round 200 and see what happens. Do you think we can get past round 200? All, let's see if we can take every single tower on at once. What, how many? How fast does it get pops? It gets pops really fast. Let's see. Like, if we have, like, an MAD, right? And then the MAD... Wait, what? And then the MAD has, like, this thing? Is this going to get pops? I mean, like, it kind of gets pops, but not really. That's where we're going to end off this video, my friends. This guy, he's just going to be sitting here munching on these balloons for all of eternity now. If you want to see more with the Balloon Shipper Paragon, hit that like button. Oh my gosh, we're going to lose. Look at this. We're going to lose. There we go. We actually lost. I thought we were going to win. No, we just lose. Well, that's how that goes. 